Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm going to show you how to make your own custom firmware for the PlayStation. Before anyone asks, no, you cannot use this for 3.56. This is only for 3.55. And the only possible way to downgrade from 3.56 is if you brick your PlayStation. But, uh, I haven't tried it, so I'm not going to tell you that it works or if it doesn't. But let's get back to the video. Um, I'm going to have a download link in the description for this folder. It's going to be called how to make custom firmware.rar. So you're going to need WinWater, open it, and then extract the folder to the desktop, and then open it up like I did. Open up the PS3 MFW builder. Extract the PS3 MFW builder folder to the desktop. Then go back and open up the PS3 free tools.rar. Go inside the tools PS3 tools folder. Hit Control A and drag and drop the tools inside the folder that you just put to the desktop. Make sure that you didn't extract the PS3 tools folder with it, because then it won't let the PS3 custom firmware builder to work all the tools need to be in the directory with the at main.tcl alright now here's the tricky part go to start start search if you're on vista and if you're on windows xp go to start and then run and then type in percent user profile percent hit enter and it'll bring you to your names directory then go to the rar and drag and drop the .ps3 file to that directory I already have it there so I will I will overwrite it whoops alright so copy it to that directory Make sure you didn't mess up like I did. Alright. Then, when you're done with that, install the Active TCL 8.5. Now, I already installed it, but I'll install it again, anyways. All right, now that it's finished, go back to the PS3 modern firmware builder, and then go to app main.tcl, double click it, and then it'll open up. There you go. And um, before anybody asks how to change the message like everyone else has when you go in to install the firmware, where it's supposed to have the user agreement go down to add a custom message to the new features installation screen hit configure and then this is how geoha and kmeow and all them made the custom message i guess instead of the user agreement it auto generates itself but you can delete and change it to what you want like i don't know my cool firmware I don't know whatever your heart desires and then this is what will go to the pup version string the build this is how you save the pup this is the original firmware thing so you're gonna have to 
download the 3.55 pup again and select it. I'll put that in the description if anyone needs it, but uh, that's about it for today, guys. If you have any questions, leave me a message or leave a comment below. See you later.